Is this crazy? I mean, by all means, keep commenting. Do whatever makes you feel better about yourself, right? But you guys got a lot of balls to try to say that we're the ones that are angry. You're straight up stalking. And throughout the entire night, all the way up until this morning, just spamming the shit out of my videos, even ones that are unrelated. I'm not going to blame you because I honestly don't know who it is, but I know for a fact somebody's disliking the shit out of these videos using multiple accounts. It's just not possible. My tiny ass channel, within seconds of uploading, gets smashed with 15 dislikes. I try to keep it fair. The likes are off nowadays by default if you haven't noticed. I put them on, so if you think the video sucks, you have a way to send me and everyone else a message. I believe in that system. And I think it's nonsense that that system has changed. We have to deal with a lot more clickbait and bullshit because of it. I've made plenty of shitty videos in the past. I know what's natural, okay? And to get hit with so many dislikes within a minute of uploading a video. And you know what the fucked up part is? When you finally get your hands on this game and you realize how fucking shallow a lot of it is, maybe you'll know how to act the next time. To say we're the ones angry when you're the ones going from video to video to video. You're the ones that are supposed to be the good guys, right? You're the ones that are supposed to be the non-haters. Positive and optimistic. Yet you're spending a lot of time hopping one video to the next video. I don't want to use the word harassing, but if it quacks like a duck. Why are you spending so much time defending this or any other game? These developers aren't going to suck your d Okay, let me just get that out of the way. They're not going to pat you on the head or personally give you your money back if you find out it's not what you expected. It's crazy. You sit there calling us angry. You sit there calling us all these things. But in reality, you're all of those things. And having a different opinion on a video game shouldn't constitute like an us versus them thing. But everything is nowadays because we have a lot more followers and leaders. I don't blame you totally. I understand that's partly because of the climate we live in today. Politicians, activists that are often just as dirty as the people that they're fighting against. And guess what? This is the exact shit many of us are fighting to prevent them from having any influence over our games. You're so oblivious. But I'll tell you one thing, when you act like this, it only encourages me. It only makes me want to make 10 more videos about this pile of crap. It's as simple as this, a lot of people aren't happy that they changed the tone for this game. And by tone, I'm talking about gangsters being replaced with a guy that looks like he fixes computers for a living. I mean, look, I don't know what other people have been doing for the past year, but I haven't been making videos on this game for the past year. In fact, I've only talked about it recently, in the past month. I can see how beating a dead horse for an entire year might get old, but don't assume that everyone's doing that. I swear, I was done. Unless I got a copy to review, I wasn't going to make another single video about this game. When you act a certain way or deploy certain tactics, you might get some people to run the other way. I charge straight towards it. So, and if that's what you want, just keep doing what you're doing. Insulting my deceased mother over a video game? I'd hate to go to a school within a hundred mile radius of you. That's all I'm saying. And since you're investing so much goddamn time into this anyway, let's just have a live debate. And you can talk about how you think the game is going to be so amazing and why. And I can explain why I think this game is going to be one of the worst Saints Row ever made. But I'm not convinced it's going to review that way because if you haven't noticed, most of the mainstream gaming media is extremely progressive. And if you happen to be a development team that's also extremely progressive, we share the same ideology, well guess what?